A no crank, no start issue refers to a situation where a vehicle's engine does not turn over when attempting to start it. And as a result, the engine does not start. This problem can be caused by a variety of factors. And troubleshooting the main issue often requires a systematic approach to identify the root cause. Reasons for no crank, no start. 1. Dead battery. A dead or weak battery is one of the most common reasons for a no crank, no start issue. If your battery is too discharged, it may not provide enough power to turn the starter motor. 2. Faulty starter motor. The starter motor is responsible for turning the engine. When you turn the ignition key, a faulty starter motor can prevent the engine from cranking. 3. Bad starter solenoid. The starter solenoid directs electrical current from the battery to the starter motor. If it fails, the starter motor won't receive the necessary electrical current to engage and turn the engine. 4. Faulty ignition switch. The ignition switch is the place where you insert your key to start the vehicle. When you turn the key, the ignition switch sends electrical power to various components, including the starter motor. When the ignition switch goes bad, it may not send the necessary signal to the starter motor. 5. Faulty Neutral Safety Switch The neutral safety switch ensures that the vehicle can only be started in the park or neutral position, or with the clutch pedal depressed. If the switch is faulty, it may prevent the engine from cranking. 6. Ignition System Issues The ignition system is responsible for producing a spark that ignites the air-fuel mixture in the engine cylinders. Problems with ignition components like the ignition coil, distributor, or ignition control module can prevent the engine from starting. 7. Fuel System Issues The engine needs fuel to start and run. If there are issues with the fuel pump, fuel filter, or fuel injectors, the engine may not receive the necessary fuel for ignition. 8. Faulty Crankshaft Position Sensor The crankshaft position sensor provides critical information to the engine control module about the position of the crankshaft. If it fails, the engine's computer may not know when to send the signal to start. 9. Wiring and connection problems Damaged or corroded electrical wires, connectors, or terminals can interrupt the flow of electricity and prevent the starter motor from receiving power. 10. Engine mechanical issues Serious engine problems, such as a seized engine due to lack of maintenance, internal damage, or a broken timing belt, can physically prevent the engine from turning over. It leads to a no-crank condition. Thanks for watching the video, and don't forget to subscribe the channel.